everyone here's a question from ratio and the question is 24 36 x are in a continued proportion find the value of x now this is a really important question the solution is very small but it's very important one now what they're saying is 24 36 x are in a continued proportion continued proportion they have given which means let me write down the ratios here here is a solution they are in continued proportion means we can write this given numbers as 24 is to 36 is proportion with 36 is to x okay this is what the continued proportion means remember that this again they have given 24 36 and x in continued proportion proportion means the ratios are equal so we can rewrite this as 24 is to x this symbol is nothing but proportion okay they are in proportion with 30 e 36 is to x now we have to find the value of x here now how to do this you have learned that if the given ratios are in proportion then the product of extremes will be equal to product of mean now what are this extreme and what are this mean the number which are in the extreme side that is 24 and x they are in the extreme side right in this given ratio so product of this two number that is product of extreme will be same as or will be equal to product of the mean so the number which are inside that is 36 and this 36 the product of this mean will product of this mean will be equal okay this is what the proportion means let us solve this one now here product of extreme will be equal to so product of extremes is equal to product of means now you have learned this that if we are in proportion this will apply here now the numbers in extreme are 24 and x so this will be equal to 24 multiplied by x is equal to product of mean product means multiplication so 36 into 36 now here we have to find out the value of x and you can see that it's like it's it's a kind of an equation here we have to find out only x here so i don't want 24 on this side i'm going to transpose this to the other side so from here we'll get x is equal to 36 multiplied by 36 divided by 24 you can multiply 36 and 36 but it will be like uh, uh, it won't take a lot of time instead of that i'm going to cancel the numbers you can cancel 36 and 24 in 12 table you can cancel this in 4 table it's completely upon you whichever table you want to cancel cancel it at the end you're going to get the same answer i'm going to directly cancel this in 12 table 12 2s are 24 12 3s are 36 we can cancel 36 and 2 once again in 2 table so 2 ones are 2 and here 2 18s are 36 okay now we are left with 3 and 8 in the numerator so multiply them so 18 3 is 54 so therefore we got the x value as 54 so therefore x is equal to 54 that's it i hope this question is clear remember continued proportion means you have to write down the ratios in this way and apply the formula that is product of extreme is equal to product of mean and get the value of x I hope this question is clear. In case you have any other question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.